Every day, millions of people travel and 70,000 bags are lost in airports around the world. When this property goes on claim, it's put up for public auction and sold to the highest bidder. Sold, sold, sold. Outrageous fortune is just a suitcase away. But if you want to strike it rich, you have to take huge risks. Billy Leroy, former ad exec, flipped his first painting for 18 grand, owns an antique and prop shop in New York City. It's all about the art of the deal. Mark Meyer, thrift shop owner from Long Island. At age 16, sold a vintage watch for 10 times what he paid. I'm a hustler. I can buy and sell anything. Lawrence and Sally Martin. He's a former aerospace engineer. She's the MBA who controls the money and her husband. They've owned an antique store in LA for 20 years. You have the big ideas and you need me to help execute the big ideas. This is Baggage Battles. So, all right, somebody kick it in for 200 and go. I got 200, 450. Hey man, I'm not scared of Billy. I think he's an old cat. I don't think he's gonna pony up the money like I will. 500? 500. 500's the bid. Anybody else? I don't want to miss anybody. 500? So! The mystery for me right now is what's in those jewelry bags. So I dumped the jewelry out and I started scouring for that one bracelet that I knew was genuine. And here it is. Beautiful. I'm coming in today to find out how well I did at the auction. You got a lot of gold here. You yeah. know what carat this is? Uh, the majority of it is 14 and 18 carat. All right, in today's market, you might have about $4,000 right there. That's incredible.